Hi guys, today in this video we are going to find out the oxidation number for chromium in Cr2SO43 and to find out the oxidation number we are first going to check the total charges on the compound. So here as you can see there are no charges of, uh, there are no negative or positive charges which means it's a neutral compound. So the sum total of the charges of chromium and SO4 is zero. So that helps us to uh, build the that helps us to understand what uh, charges can we expect out of a Cr2 and SO4. So now to find out the charges for Cr2, first we are going to look at the charges of SO4 and we can also follow this general rules that can help you to understand the process better. So the SO4 uh, as a group completely has a charge of minus 2 but as there are uh, 3 of them uh, present here, we are going to multiply this number by 3. So in total the charges on SO4 is minus 6 and as I have mentioned above, as I have mentioned earlier, the total charges for this compound is zero. So as it has the charges of minus six, there will be charges of plus six on chromium. But here also there are two atoms of chromium present. So each chromium atom will have a oxidation number of three and hence will have a charge of plus three, which means that chromium in Cr2SO4 three has a three as, a, as its oxidation number. Now you can apply the same formula and find out the oxidation number of other atoms as well. For example, if we consider sulfur, we do not know the oxidation number of sulfur in this compound, but we do know that oxygen has an oxygen has an oxidation number of minus two, and uh, the complete charges on SO four is minus two. So what we know is the charges on my uh, oxygen, the oxidation number of oxygen, and the charges on SO four. So to find out this, we are going to make this simple equation where we are assuming that x uh, is the value of sulfur, and we are multiplying this number by four because there are four oxygen atoms and each oxygen atom will have a oxidation number of two and hence will have the charge of minus two so we are going to multiply this number and in the total we are getting the charge as minus two so x plus uh, four into minus two is equals to minus two which means x minus eight is equals to minus two and we are going to take the numbers over there so x is equals to six so the total charges on the sulfur or the oxidation number of sulfur is six for uh, this e for this compound and this uh, the sulfur here has a plus six oxidation number chromium has a plus three and oxygen has a minus two so following this general use you can find out the oxidation number of different atoms and ions make sure to uh, subscribe to our channel to watch other videos on lewis structure molecular geometry polarity of the molecules and such uh, equations and concepts and thank you for watching